Here's how you can configure your bleed and margin guide colours. To configure your bleed guide colour, head to the document setup located in the context toolbar. We will then select the bleed tab and you'll see this new colour guide configuration. To set a new colour, you have many options. You can use the colour picker or the HSL wheel. You have even more colour selection methods just in the drop down here. Your bleed guide colour will also be available throughout the whole document. To configure the margin guide colours, let me first locate my master. The margins can be set to a different colour throughout your document. If you want your guides to be the same colour, use this method of first selecting your master, then change your margin guide colour. Just head to View and Guides Manager. You'll see you'll have the same configuration options as we did for the bleed guides. The margin guide colours have now been configured to this master. This means every page or spread that is assigned to the master will also share the same configuration. If you want to have different coloured margins for a particular spread, just select the page and head to View, Guides Manager. As you can see, both the bleed and the margin guides can be edited at any time. The new coloured guides will be saved within your document, so when you open it back up again, it will remember your preferences for this document. It is really handy to tailor your guide colours as every document is different and has individual needs.